Here's a behind the scene look at the basics I use for each of my tutorials. Tin foil for your polish palette, acetone and a brush for cleanup, and paper towel. This behind the scenes tutorial will feature this purple floral mani using the polishes pictured here. I'll list these polishes below as well. For each of my tutorials I use this cheap, well used brush from Walmart for my cleanup. I use tin foil for my polish palette and I use these little shot glasses from the dollar store to hold my pure acetone. Dab your polish that you're going to use for your design right on top of that tin foil. And don't put a lot out, you can just reapply rather than put too much out and have waste. I don't always mix my polish, but today I felt like doing the swirl look to my floral pattern, so I'm just mixing up the colors as I go. This tutorial won't really show you the full design here on my nail, it's more for the behind the scenes look. I will include a link below in the description to my Floral Manny playlist because I have lots of tutorials on creating flowers of all sorts. For each of my manis, I work on top of a piece of folded paper towel. I'm constantly wiping my brush on the paper towel outside of the frame. This way you don't have to see all my dirty little work in the background. When creating very fine lines, it's important not to dab off the acetone. I take my brush straight from the acetone into the polish on my polish palette and then straight to my nail and this helps keep the polish nice and thin. I try not to waste anything and get as much use out of my product as I can. So when I'm done with a mani, I set the tin foil aside and allow it to dry. The next time I do a mani, I flip it over and use the other side. I also take the paper towel I'm working on and flip it over and reuse it for my next mani. When I'm done using both sides of the paper towel, I wet it with acetone and clean my shot glasses. And there you have it, the behind the scenes look. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you liked the video. Please comment, share, subscribe, and thumbs up are always appreciated.